You're out of time. You have had your hour. And yes, I know you're still there, Lieutenant. And yes, you too, the ever-faithful Clint. But as always, Victoria, the decision is yours. No, you're wrong, Mitch. The final decision is mine. Jessica, is that you? That's right. And I know what you want. And the answer is yes. You can have me as soon as you tell us where Natalie is. Give her back and I'm yours. You went to prison, Troy, because of what you did to me. And after you were gone, I had to pick up the pieces of my life and move on. I fell in love with Bo again. We have a family. We've been to hell and back together, and we've stayed together. I'm sorry, Troy, but nothing, nothing can ever make me forget my husband. Actually, not. There is. What is that? What is that? You've had it before, Nora. Your old friend Lindsay gave it to you. Troy said that he and Nora and Matthew were going to be a family soon? Yes, but that's not going to happen. No, it's not, because now I think I know where they are. Where? The shack that he went to when he kidnapped Matthew. Keep that away from me. It's going to make you feel so much I don't need it. I don't need any medicine. It's going to make everything so much easier. To do what? Nora, once you've had your medicine, your life with Bo will, will be like a dream that never happened. A dream you can't remember. And then you and I can spend the rest of our life together. There is no way in hell that we're trading Jessica to Mitch. Let's do it. No, Jessica, you cannot do this! If I don't, then Mitch will kill Natalie. And what's he going to do to you? He won't get a chance. Is that a hope or a promise? I promise I'm bringing both your daughters home safe. Jessica is on her way here. I'll finally be able to give her a proper baptism into my church. Jessica, what will never go with you? I think my daughter knows her scripture. Let's see, how does it go? Honor your father so that you may live long in the land the Lord your God has given you. You're not her father. She will obey me. If she wants her sister to live. What's the secret you and Star are keeping? I can't tell you. I thought we were baseball buddies. Let's go, Phillies. Well, so how can you keep a secret from me? Sam, it's okay, buddy. You can tell me. I know it's about Cole, isn't it? Cole, what are you doing? The same thing you are. Kissing the person I love. Last time Troy got out, he took Matthew to Lantano Mountain. I'll drive. No, you're not coming, Lindsay. Oh, yes, I am. I know how Troy thinks. And I can deal with him. But you know what? He thinks you're the cause of all his problems. I can talk to him. Yeah, but we're not going to argue. You're right. I'll navigate. What are you talking about? You remember what Lindsay did to you in Cherryville?
What is that? It's my way out of this. For death by lethal injection, you're gonna kill me? After keeping me alive all these months now, you're gonna kill me? I'm not gonna kill you. I'm always gonna be there with you. No matter where you are, no matter how happy you are. Even if you come back with Bo, I'll be right by your side. Always reminding you of what you did to me. I will never let you forget what you did to me. Well, I'll take that chance. Because you won't remember. You won't remember anything after I give you this shot. That's the same. And that is the same drug that Lindsay gave me. And it was wrong of her to do that. Yes. Yes, it was. It's because she's not a trained medical professional. Oh, God, no. Not like no. me. No. No. Nora. No. I might not have my license anymore, but no. I'm still a doctor. No. No. Trust me. No. Trust me. No. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Trust me. Sam. Sam. Hey. Sam. It's about Star and Cole. I know it is. It's Star. Listen. Sam, I know why Star didn't want to tell me, but the secret could get her into a lot of trouble. How? Well, if she's helping hide Cole and the cops find out, she could go to jail. Again? Yeah. And you don't want that, do you? Me neither. So you gotta help me out, okay? You be a hero. Is Star hiding Cole? Check the cabana. That's my buddy. Well, you didn't hear from me. You got it. I can't. I can't. I'm not going back to jail, Star. We can be together. I, I, I can't, Cole. I told you, you why. You, me, and our little girl. You want us to just run away with you? The cops won't catch us. I'm with James. You told me you understood. I lied. I know what I told you because I didn't want you to wait for me. You lied? I said what you needed to hear, but I loved you when I said it. <laughs> and I love you now. I don't care who you're with now. You still love me, too. We have an update from the press officer at Statesville Prison. Authorities are revising the total number of escaped prisoners to 198. transferred to Statesville from St. Anne's, where she was initially confined for psychiatric treatment. Ms. Hey, O'Connor was committed after she attempted to bury Star Manning and her boyfriend James Ford In other news... You can only bring Natalie and me home safe if you bring me with you as Pete. You do what I say. Sure, no, yes. Not, not sure. All right, it's got to be yes, all right? You do what I say and only what I say. No, I'm going to do my own thing and try to save the day. Understood? Understood. Good. Let's get going. Please, please, please listen to John. And be careful. I promise, okay? Honey, we love you so much. I love you, too. Listen, in an hour, this will all be over, and I'll bring Natalie home, okay? Okay. You ready? Yes, let's go. Bye, Jesse. Let's go. Bye. See you soon. John. You take care of her. Oh, God, please, please, please keep my girl safe. so obsessed with Jessica when you've got me right here. Hmm. You're a bargaining chip. Well, I, I can be so much more than that. Can you now? Yeah, I mean, why would you want Jessica? I mean, when she's been crazy for the past couple of years. Well, she didn't fragment after our time together. Really? After you almost raped her? Yeah, she um, thought she was 17 years old for months. It was prophesized that I would have another heir. But I misread the signs. But the prophecy still stands. 
I will have another heir. Mm. Yes. The Lord has shown me the way. The mother of my son is before me. Don't you know it's nice to share? Not with you. Ouch! I'm really fun. I saw you on TV. You hurt Star. Not really. But Star hurt me first. Star! Hey, 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 hey. Inside voice. Understand? Okay. You be quiet or I'll give you a reason to yell. Got it? If I take my hand away, you'll be quiet? I'll leave you alone, I promise, kid. You just gotta tell me where to find Star and Cole. Eddie. I thought that you left. Yeah, I got that. You knew he was here the whole time? James. You lied to me. I lied to the cops, not you. Same thing. Star, you almost got thrown into prison when you helped your dad escape from jail last fall. What do you think? Is gonna happen if they catch you now. Star had nothing to do with it. Damn it. Are you that stupid? They don't care if Star busted you out of Statesville. If she hides you, she is your accomplice. How could you put her in that position? I helped Cole because I wanted to. It was my choice, James, and I would do it again. Why? Is he right? No matter who you're with now, you love Cole? Now, John McBain is not going to let things get out of hand. Oh, Clint, for heaven's sakes, with Mitch Lawrence, things are always out of control. Where's Jessica? There's the front door just standing open. I'm sorry, I heard about the breakout at Statesville in the news. Is everybody okay? Yes, we're fine. Where does Jessica know that Mitch escaped? She's heard. Well, where is she? Is she upstairs? No, no. She didn't take Ryder anywhere, did she? I mean, she, she wouldn't do that, not with Mitch on the loose, right? We should tell him. Uh, okay, Jessica is uh, not home. Well, well, why not? Where is she? Does Mitch have her? No, Mitch doesn't have her. Mitch has Natalie. You know, when I first returned to Landview, I chose you for my mate. And you, Natalie, fell in love with me. I never loved you. Well, believe me, honey, you would have if we'd been able to consummate our marriage as husband and wife should. If you so much as breathe <laughs> in my direction, I swear to God, I will tell you. Oh, I love that feistiness. <laughs> oh, yeah, kick. You'll be kicking, all right. I love that fire in you, girl. You know what? I believe our children will have that fire one day. I think John will be here soon. Yes. I wish we could take our time, but uh, I promise you, my lovely, I'm sure <laughs> that you enjoy yourself. Relax, sit down. Make yourself comfortable. You don't want to do this, Troy. You'll never let go of Bo if I don't. What happened to the man I loved? Who? Hmm? I'm right here. No. No, what happened to the man that came to Landview? That's the one I cared about. He was so good to me. Okay. Yeah, she seemed to be, but uh, MacGyver's got a gun and what looked like a syringe. Oh, no, that's not good. Could you hear what they were saying? You made sure Lindsay paid for what she did to me. 
Tori, you came up with a treatment that made me whole again. Why would you, why would you want to do this? To give us a second chance, Nora. God was gonna do the same thing to Nora that you did. Gonna wipe out her memory and 